Aries people, um, this new moon takes place in your ninth house, which is Sagittarius, and as there is no other, um, any other aspect for me between other planets and this Sun Moon conjunction, so we can ignore this part. Okay, um, the only thing we have. Oh, um, so actually this new moon chart is relatively simple and the only thing, the only thing we have to pay attention to, especially for you guys or girls, Aries people, is that um, Mars, which is your ruler, is in Scorpio, which is called domicile, which means it is so powerful. It has its energy. It has all its energy. It can um, exert its energy so naturally. Okay. And then Mars is opposing the retrograding, okay, the retrograding Uranus, or some say Uranus, in Taurus, and it is considered a fall. It is not exerting its energy. It can't exert its energy, okay? So there is this opposition between them. Okay, so what does it mean to you guys or girls? It means that you are going to be involved in other people's money, okay? For example, um, you're going to lend people money. People need your help, okay? Mm -hmm. Or um, there are some monetary conflicts or arguments or um, just anything like that of, this, of, of a similar, similar kind between other people and you just go to help them or you are invited to go to help them as a, let's say, a middleman or a mediator um, or a guarantor. Yeah, something like that. So you're going to be involved in other people, other people's businesses, okay? Money businesses, okay? Or if it's not necessarily about money, then it is about work. So in your working environment, you are going to be um, also a middleman, a mediator, to um, yeah, just to balance uh, the um, just to do some balancing work bet um, between different sides. Okay, and the themes actually match with each other because like when you work. I think the sole purpose is to earn money, right? Okay, so work and money, they're so intertwined. They can't be separated, okay? They can't be seen as two concepts, okay? Yeah, so this is what tarot and the stars tell me together. But then, um, so do you, um, so some people may think, oh, so does it mean it's going to cause a lot of troubles to me? Well, no, I wouldn't say there, there are going to be troubles, okay? Because after all, we say, um, what is that phrase again? What is that saying? It is more blessed to to give than to receive, right? Okay, so um, I think it's always a good thing to help people, and and it, it really okay. Believe me, it's not going to cause you any big troubles. Okay, it just cause it's just going to cause you um some time, I guess. Okay, and some energy. Okay, so if you are really having troubles, I would recommend Leo. Okay, yeah. So get a Leo to help you out. Okay, and there are several auspicious days. Yeah, so it's actually December 6th, okay, from the 6th to the 10th, okay, so especially for you to deal with these money matters of other people, okay, so if you want to um, handle these matters successfully and um, um, with ease, okay, so you choose um, any day between uh, the 6th and the 10th of December, yeah, so good luck to you guys.